Welcome to the Tornado Turbine Roof Ventilator Installation Procedure for corrugated IBR roofs without insulation. Before beginning the installation process, ensure you have all the necessary safety equipment, tools, and materials on hand. 1. Begin by placing the base plate onto the roof and marking the hole to be cut. Ensure that the base plate is positioned 50 mm under the ridge cap for proper alignment. 2. Using an angle grinder, cut the marked hole square to accommodate the base plate. 3. Using a wide-nosed vice grip, bend the sheeting back at the bottom to avoid rainwater and weather from entering under the base plate. 4. Securely attach the base plate to the roof using rivets. 5. Waterproof the base plate using silicon or membrane and sealer to prevent any water leakage. 6. Using tin snips, cut angled wedges out of the base plate. and then gently hammer the base plate down to follow the contour of the roof. It is now time to mount the Tornado Roof Ventilator. 7. Place the throat and dome section onto the base plate, ensuring proper alignment. 8. Check that the locking brackets are loose so that you can adjust the throat angle as needed. 9. Adjust the throat to achieve a level position from the top section of the throat and dome. 10. Once the throat and dome are in a level position, securely fasten the locking brackets to ensure stability. 11. Don't forget to tighten the locking bracket and rivet it into place. By following these steps and ensuring you have the necessary safety equipment, tools and materials, you'll be able to effectively install the Tornado Turbine Roof Ventilator on your corrugated or IBR roof, providing efficient ventilation for your building.